Hi, I'm Brittany with the Lebanon Public Library here to bring you a hashtag 52 books in 52 weeks video. This week's selection is Born a Crime by Trevor Noah, a, uh, a memoir about a biracial child growing up during South African apartheid. Now, many of you may know Trevor from The Daily Show or from one of his stand-up comedy specials. And I gotta say, the same charm and wit that makes him so successful on stage really comes out in his book. Now, what I really liked about it is the fact that he can so seamlessly blend that particularly violent era of South African history with his own personal history. You know, one moment he'll ask you to bear witness to some very, very violent ways that people treat each other. And the next he'll invite you to laugh with him at a particularly funny moment from his childhood. Um, and through it all, you can really feel the strong presence of his mother as he recounts all the ways she taught him to not only survive in their world full of hardship, but thrive. Just like in one of my favorite excerpts from the book, which I'll read for you now. <clears throat> Obviously, I was not the only child born to black and white parents during apartheid. Traveling around the world today, I meet other mixed South Africans all the time. Our stories start off identically were around the same age. Their parents met at some underground party in Hillbrow or Cape Town. They lived in an illegal flat. The difference is that in virtually every other case, they left. The white parents smuggled them out through Lesotho or Botswana, and they grew up in exile in England or Germany or Switzerland, because being a mixed family under apartheid was just that unbearable. Once Mandela was elected, we could finally live freely exile started to return. I met my first one when I was around 17. He told me his story and I was like, wait, what? You mean we could have left? That was an option? Imagine being thrown out of an airplane. You hit the ground and break all your bones. You go to the hospital and you heal and you move on and finally put the whole thing behind you. And then one day somebody tells you about parachutes. That's how I felt. I couldn't understand why we'd stayed. I went straight home and asked my mom, why? Why didn't we just leave? Why didn't we go to Switzerland? Because I am not Swiss, she said, as stubborn as ever. This is my country. Why should I leave? I think that students of history and fans of comedy alike will enjoy Born a Crime by Trevor Noah. Now you can find a copy of the book in our nonfiction section, or you can find a digital copy on the Libby by Overdrive app which everyone who has a library card with us has access to. Thanks for watching.